vlog slash recipe so today um not a lot's been going on it's been chucking it down with rain so we haven't been able to get out of the house which i wanted to but um no such luck today um zach's getting a wobbly tooth his first wobbly tooth so he's really excited he's like wobbling it <laughs> and, i'm um, gonna help so today i'm i'm gonna be Good doing a recipe gonna help. So today's recipe is uh, chicken biryani. Yes. So you are going to need. No, you need to go away because I'm filming. Let me just grab the computer to tell you exactly what we're going to be needing. Get out. You have to film elsewhere, Zach. I'm busy. Kids. Right. Um, I'm only using the one oil, but it states you can use two oils. So you need two teaspoons of sunflower oil one large onion chopped so i've got my onion there uh, 300 grams of uh, skinless ow, chicken breast uh, cut into chunks but again i've brought my chicken chunks and there is 500 grams in there i think but i like my chicken <laughs> uh, one red pepper i think what's that chopped does not dust or anything it's just chopped uh, you need one carrot. That was my one. Dice. I've got these packs of little I carrots. I'm just going to chop them up. Uh, you need eight mushrooms. Sliced. You need one aubergine. But I'm using, I'm, I'm using a courgette. So one courgette. Courgette. Um, you need one tablespoon of curry paste, which can be mild, medium, or hot, depending on your um taste and what you like uh, so i've got the medium and i've gone for a balti or balti balti whatever you call it uh one tablespoon of sultanas i'm not keen so i'm leaving them out 300 grams of basmati rice so we've got a pack of rice um 800 mils of boiling water uh, 100 grams of frozen peas, defrosted, but I'm just going to throw them in and cook them. And a handful of fresh coriander, um, chopped, and one tablespoon of olive oil. But I'll be using the extra virgin olive oil both times. I'm not going to use the sunflower oil. So guys, I hope you like this recipe and I hope you're going to enjoy it. And if you do make it, let me know in the comments. Remember to always like, comment and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll be back in a minute.
we are going to cook the onions for roughly two minutes. And then hey guys, we'll they'll be cooking for roughly two minutes, maybe just a tad longer. So I'm going to add the chicken. the onions put it back onto a medium heat and then we're going to let that cook for roughly three to four minutes okay guys i've been cooking for about five minutes and now we are going to add the courgette the mushroom the carrots and the peppers so just bear with me coming back in the fall Doesn't it look colourful? You notice I've changed pans. I just thought this was going to be wider and easier to cook in, and also you guys can see it as well. They're not hidden in the pan. So we're going to let these cook for roughly five minutes. I've lost a mushroom. Turn that back up to about a medium. And then we'll be back. Hey guys, so while we're waiting for that to cook, I think there's about three minutes left on the uh, timer. I uh, thought I'd just go through some fun facts with you. Uh, they're under kids' fun facts, but I sometimes like the kids' ones, they're quite funny. Uh, um, oh, right, okay, so I'm going to go through that in a minute. Um, I'm going to add Zach's channel, uh, YouTube channel link in the description, guys. If you've got kids that like watching gaming um, and vlogs as well, if you guys like Zach's vlogs when you've seen them sometimes, uh, he's going to be doing a bit of both on his channel. Um, he hasn't done anything for a while on his channel, but he wants to get back into um, filming his games and doing a little bit of vlogging here and there. Um, so there will be a video up tonight on there. And uh, so I'd like you guys to head over and give him a subscribe and uh, a little comment down again if you can. Uh, that'd be really lovely. So anyway, I'm just going to do a few quick few fun facts just while waiting. So... Did you know that 80% of vanilla flavoured food, including the ice cream and essence, is made artificially because natural vanilla beans are very expensive? Kangaroos. Did you know kangaroos cannot walk backwards? And if you think about it, they, they can't really sort of like jump, don't they? <laughs> uh, the lighter. Did you know the lighter was invented long back before the matchbox and matchsticks were invented? So I thought that would have been the other way around. That's uh, good to know. <laughs> uh, lipsticks, we've done this one. Uh, lipsticks are not vegan cosmetics. More than 95% of lipsticks contain fish scales. <laughs> Venus is the only planet in the solar system that rotates clockwise, whereas all the other planets rotate anti-clockwise. I think we've done that one before. Uh, rabbits and parrots. Did you know that rabbits and parrots can see what is behind them without turning their heads? Okay, that's the, the timer. We'll do a few more. Volcanoes. Did you know that Australia is the only continent in the world that has no volcanoes? I did not. Hands and feet uh, have more than half of the bone have more than half of the bones in the human body. Honey. Did you know that there is no expiry date to honey? The edible food remains good forever until used otherwise, like using a wet spoon. Uh, dog nose prints, I think, have we done these? I think we've done some of these. Uh, just like human fingerprints, dog's nose prints are unique and it can be used to identify uh, the identity of a dog. Uh, apples float on water. Most of us know this anyway. <laughs> oh my god, my battery's dying. It's been on charge for ages. Okay. Um, and the number four is the only number that has the same number of alphabets slash letters. Let's get okay, on cooking, guys. guys. So at this point, you're going to want to add your curry paste and your sultanas but remember guys i'm not having sultanas because i don't like them so just let that heat up and then give it a little stir um 
Then, once we've mixed this around, we're going to add our rice. Oh, that smells so nice. Love curry. Love, love curry. Gotta make sure the veg vegetables and everything get a bit of the paste. I have added a bit more paste, as you probably saw. That's just for flavour, mainly. So you guys can do the same. If you're not an over big fan of curry, then I'll keep it to the amount. Okay, so we're nearly all covered. Mmm, it's like being in India. <laughs> oh, guys, that's delicious smelling anyway. Delicious smelling at the moment. Okay, so we're going to add our rice. So let's grab the rice. Give that a little stir. And then you're going to add your water to it in a minute. If my camera cuts out, guys, it's because the battery is going. So I'll just put up a picture of it at the end if it does cut out but hopefully it lasts just a little tad longer okay so then you're going to want to add your water i'm only going to add a very little bit because i don't like too much water in here and cook for about 10 minutes okay guys cook for about 10 minutes once the water's added see you in a minute 